Hello, YouTube land people. So I want to ask you a very serious question, and I don't want you to think that I'm going to judge you for it or anything like that. Um, I won't because it's an important question, and I'm kind of I kind of want to do some research on my own this way. So try to answer me honestly if you can. Um, to the best of your knowledge, to the, the best ability of to what you know how your own body reacts to certain things. And that is, since this um, nuclear Fukushima meltdown thing ha has happened, have you ate, do you still eat fish, especially tuna? Because as you may or may not know, most tuna does live around that area of Japan. Um, most tuna comes from the Japan area. And um, and if you do, if you are still eating the tuna, um, I just want to know, have you been getting more sick lately? More, have, more th have you noticed anything different going on with your body? Anything um, like more, more of something that you don't never had before? Um, different things like that? And... Um, yeah, so that's what I wanted to know. Um, again, I'm not going to judge you for it. I know that, um, you know, there there's a lot of d destructive practices that go on in the ocean as far as, um, you know, getting stuff, especially from the sea bottom. Um, scraping the sea bottom for, like, clams or whatever is very destructive. And so is overfishing. But the thing that would bother me the most is um, the contamination, not just radioactive contamination, but, you know, the oil, the Corexit, the mercury, all this other pollutants, um, you know, the, the plastics, all this stuff. And that bothers me um, because I really try to be as healthy as possible. And I know that, you know, we evolved probably most likely most of us did evolve to eat um, fish because you get a lot of omega-3s and different fatty acids that you need. Not that you can't adapt to other things like coconuts or um, nuts or seeds, but, you know, we evolved a certain way and, it, and, it, and to adapt and to evolve another way takes time. And um, if, if it makes you feel better, you know, to eat some um, seafood once in a while, then then good for you. But um, I th I actually think that's what made me sick, and that's why I'm asking you. As you may or not know, I spent some time in Australia, and they're not necessarily at all uh, vegan friendly down there, um, especially where I was in Melbourne, and I was very very limited to what I could eat. Uh, a lot of the cafes and different places to eat at close very early down there usually by eight o'clock everything's closed up and usually on Sunday even earlier than that and I usually don't have dinner until around eight or so or nine and um, I just had very very limited access to what I could eat for my dinner down there and a lot of the restaurants I later found out use different things from different animals in their dishes even though the dishes would say vegetarian it would still have um, maybe a stock of uh, chicken or fish or something in it. And um, I was just, you know, um, at a point where I just didn't give a fuck anymore, put it that way. Because it's late, everything's closing up, I'm starving, I have to eat dinner, you know, I got to get back home to go to bed, to get up the next day. It was like very, um, just hectic to say the least, just always running, running, running. Never had time. Um, I mean, I had some free time, but most of my time I spent just very extremely busy. And um, so that kind of wore me down, too. And plus the noise pollution, um, trying to sleep at night with all this traffic and bells and whistles and construction and just noise, 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 constant noise. And it was just horrendous to say the least. I, I don't know how anyone could stand living like that. I'm so glad to be back here in Hawaii where it's peaceful, where all I have 
are the little croakies at night to sing me to sleep, which I love. Um, not to get off subject, but um, yeah, I really just want to know about do you still eat fish? What kind? How often have you gotten any ill effects that you think may, may or may not be from the fish that you would normally not have? Um, let's see. Yeah, I think that's all. Okay, so talk to you later. Take care.